This is about Jones Beach. When I was a kid, Jones Beach was where everyone went to uh, twice a month, maybe, uh, uh, on the weekends. Uh, Salisbury Park would be the spring and the fall when it got a little cooler. Um, and then I remember sometime in the 73, 74, uh, Jones Beach got too expensive and they had to go to Nassau County Beach. But then uh, my dad had some of the, those other people fake give, give him their addresses so that they could fake, we could get a fake ID so that we could go use that beach too. Um, but uh, I think your dad has a, a poetic moment where he talks about how even though they live right next to Jones Beach, uh, for most New Yorkers, it's been decades since they've been there, not years, but decades. Oh, yeah. And that that's true. That's one of the things about New York uh, is that New York is very much, it, it's really like if you smush 200 small villages together uh, mm -hmm. and uh, people, you know, you could literally uh, live somewhere like I lived in Glendale and let's say where the Mets played in Old Shea Stadium or now City Field, the New York Mets baseball team uh, is really only about I don't think it's more than six or seven miles, but it's straight up. You have to go through three or four other neighborhoods. It, driving is a pain in the ass. It might take you 45, 50 minutes to just go six or seven miles. So people in New York don't do that uh, generally. Uh, you would take a train to go to Shea Stadium if you're gonna go. Uh, and a lot of people just don't go uh, anyway. Um, but uh, 